Okay, welcome to a Graver's Choice. Graver's Choice has made a whole laser course on the graphical interface laser works, presented to you by Boss Laser. This graphical interface will work with most RD controllers, but it's really perfected for the Boss Laser. And the course is broken down into uh, sections. Each section has four subsections and three little areas in, in, within each subsection. Each, each uh, video is three to five minutes long, uh, so you can absorb them easily. It's broken down into the installation section, how to install the laser, all the nomenclatures involved to be able to run the laser, how to create your first job in LaserWorks, how to interface it with Engrave Lab and CorelDRAW. It will interface with Adobe, but those are the two we concentrate on because I'm an Engrave Lab and, and um, CorelDRAW trainer. It goes through uh, project videos, and uh, it also has things on how to dial the machine in for different materials, technical one-on-one -on -one training for just how lasers work in general, PC training, making a positioning table, uh, project jobs, as I said before, cleaning your optics, which is critical, beam alignment, preventative maintenance, troubleshooting, and then the different sorts of uh, uh, power and speed settings, which we have fast keys for. Now, if we get out of this and we go into Engrave Lab, for example, you will see what we call our power cell. You click the power cell and it drops over. So over here, I'm going to grab a, a unit and I'm going to click here. And all I have to do to make this into something that's laserable is go to my interactive, tell it what, what source I want to go to, what type of material and um, click OK and it automatically makes it. And from there, all I do is grab it and click on the power cell and it drops it into LaserWorks. This is LaserWorks. So if I go from here, I can also do cool things like nesting. The cool thing about nesting is if I go here and tell it that I want to uh, see my entire object, and I select it and I go back to my nesting portion I can tell it that I want to go to the selected object notice it's not there and then when I it automatically nests those in there that way instead of taking a full 24 by 48 sheet I can take a 24 by 24 sheet and get the same thing saving lots of money making lots more profit now with Corel draw I can just take the existing unit that I made here because I've signed different colors, click on my power cell, and then once I do, it appears in engrave uh, in um, LaserWorks. Double click, assign my power and speeds. I can assign a library, or more so, there is a library that is assigned to the unit that we've already put in there for you. Um, this is part of the installation and training, how to make like how to make triangles with right within Engrave Lab if you need to instead of squares. Now, the other thing is that if we go here and we get out of this one and we go back to Krell, I want you to notice that I have done a power cell, which means I took it and, and basically power clipped it in, separated so I could tile it. These are all things that we have in our Corel Draw or Engrave Lab training courses that are, that are done in coordination with LaserWorks. So if I double click into my LaserWorks course, this is the layout you will get. So you will get extra manuals, extra structural videos, extra clip art, power cell jobs, you know, different extra items, doc, training documents, etc. And I want you to notice that, that one of the things that you do get is the ability to do variable text within CorelDRAW. It's called um, Laser Jumpstart. Now I purposely made one square that was different just to show you that that square was different, just so I could show you that you could make changes after it was done. The big thing here though is that if you just buy RD Works or LaserWorks and you try to install it yourself, you're gonna be very, very frustrated. You need to call me. I either do a PC to PC installation or I do uh, on site. If it's your first laser, you definitely want to do it on site. Thank you.